Jamie Fofo here. I'm back uh, taking my bike out on the uh, public road for the first time. I thought this was the uh, best chance for me to really test out the wattage and how long it's going to maintain the, the, the high power. So I was really wanting to get it out. Yeah. I got it all out right now trying to trying to keep it up to 28 30 99 percent on the my uh, pedal assist not uh nine right now you can see it's kind of like staying in the 700s It seems like it's still kind of hard to maintain 28 on this. And it's not all that unlevel. <sighs> it's, it's a nice pretty day to get out riding though. And I'm also taking this to uh, a little route that's not too far from me. Uh, it's an actual real off-road ride. It's not like what I took on Iron Hill Trail the other day. I even had the comment of someone saying the that trail looked uh, smoother than the than a lot of their uh, pavement around around where they live. So, I mean, it is definitely smooth. That's why I wanted to try to go out to this one. This is a, this is a trail I've taken four wheelers off and everything. So, I'm gonna see how this thing did on it. Yeah, I'm going 800, 900 right here. See how it does this little slide up here. And I also put uh, my turn signals on right here. You can see it. But for my helmet, I was trying to adjust the the brake sensitivity with it, just because I don't know, uh, uh, it's just a, a little extra something to give me, uh, give me, make me visible while I'm out on the bike. But I do like the little turn signals. But I got it set to beep right now. I don't know if I'll keep it, but you'll hear it. Let's wait for traffic a little bit right here. And I can go. Turn that off. A little extra stuff. I don't know. I don't know if anybody notices that or not. I put the beep just so I wouldn't have a turn signal on the entire time if I don't look down. There we go. I'm almost hitting 30 today. Yeah, I'm gonna give you that. I'm gonna give you that peak power all the time. But I saw a thousand hit. Probably won't want to get up uh, uphill a little bit. So that.
Start exploring a little bit more of these roads now. I just had to get this out on the road first time. See how I like it. Get to the top of this hill. I'm gonna try to see this. It's helping me climb a little bit. Nine hundred thousand. I was trying to keep it on water just in case y'all could see it. Actually. down though so Keep up speed. Very well, so I can see you past me. <laughs> what about assist? <laughs> Over here, let me get some. A little bit of a grade over here. Yeah, I don't think there's going to be too much traffic on this, but I'll never know. Around this time during the day. Have to try it. As long as I'm being seen tomorrow. <laughs>
Feel about these hills without without the e bike. That trail went to. I might stop figure it out real quick. I'll be right back. All right. While well, I was trying to figure out where I was at, uh, I just went ahead and deflated the tires. So I got my front to uh, let's see so eight psi. And my rear to uh, 10 PSI, that's somebody was suggesting it in the last video. So I just kind of looked on the map, it looks like a, I thought the dirt went a little bit sooner right here. But it's just like a, just right around the corner right here. But we're going to go ahead and get ready. Let's see how this thing does. I don't know. It's going to be a lot of me testing around again. I don't know which uh, mode I want to be in, but I'm trying out sport mode right now. You can kind of tell this is uh, a full wheel trip. Come on, sport. Come on. Well, it'll help pedal a little bit. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. That wasn't too bad. We're going to stay in a lower gear, though. And I ain't never off road with a. <laughs> two wheels or anything so i'll probably probably gonna take it a little easy first time out here but i don't know i want to bring people along there ain't no snakes or anything in the bushes over here for me this and i think you yeah, go right here. Whew. I'm gonna bust my butt. <laughs> All right, let's see. I'm gonna take some. <laughs> some of these easy though. Don't judge me. It's a whole lot easier when you get used to <laughs> doing all the four wheeler. Well. Oh, oh shoot. Come on, come on, come on. 
Oh. Okay, this is no iron ultra. <laughs> I'm gonna give out on this. Try and fix my cable. Come on. No, 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 no. <laughs> I can tell you the suspension's doing doing the shot. That's for sure. I might change batteries here soon. I didn't have the secondary one charged all the way. I think it's going to need the... Oh, oh. there's the, the wetness coming off. Not having them fender, fender flares. Oh. So pretty out there. Yeah, let me go ahead and just swap the battery. I think once you get in that red and the 20 and 30 percent, it's pretty much done. All right. Turn you off. Unhook you. Twirl. Undo the flat. Oh, not the undo the flat. That's for charging. Okay. Got that plugged up. Button press, back on. Came pretty quick with that. Oh, getting a little bit better in my swing over too. All right, let's go back up now. Give me some power. Power, more. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there's the 1200 watts. Maybe I only get that on the big battery too. I don't know, I didn't even think about that. I mean, it's just standing up like it was suggested to me. Nope, nope, no, 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 I'm gonna get splashed. No fender flares. Making it easy, dude. Yeah, splash, splash, splash. Oh, it's a little lot more than water there. A little oily looking. I think I remember some of these spots now on the full weather, but you don't really care on the full weather. Oh, <laughs> well, shoot. I don't know how I feel first time taking this through, and I can't tell how deep the water is right there, too. Because if I try to go slow, I'm going to be dipping in. And it's going to be a lot of water flashing back up. Oh. Let me see, I'm thinking. So this ease into it. Oh, 
Here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh, sorry about, sorry about. I tried to ease. I didn't want to splash. <laughs> I got a little wet in my shoe. Okay. Oh, they're doing some uh, Jeep, Jeep testing over here now this time. I just want that, uh, that quiet cat. <laughs> got the, the Jeep name on it. That thing is pretty Yeah, it'd be nice to have the suspender players on this. Man, this might actually be a little bit more fun than on a full wheeler just because it's just doing more things and uh, <laughs> keeping it balanced. Oh, getting spiced. Yeah. yeah, this thing's going to get cleaned after this. I don't know how far I'm going to go on here. Maybe I should be watching my trip distance. It's hard to use the, the small battery. Uh, or I got reserves, but I know that's not going to last forever. Let's get that 12 on. Oh, it's slinging me. Yeah. I might, I'll have to show the bike a little bit. <laughs> Mud flying up on it. Oh, I'm still getting splashed right in the face. Tire. Yeah, I hope I <laughs> just have to endure it. It is what it is. I have no idea how I would even pedal this. It's a lot of <laughs> to crawl. Yeah, by the time we get the tires dry, there's a little wet spot anyway. Oh, 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 that was a little deeper than I thought. <laughs> I sunk in right there. Let's show. Look at that. Oh, uh, yeah, this thing's definitely getting a, a bath. I'm sorry, anyway. It's probably the, uh, the worst anyone's treated you since. Camera out. Oh. Oh, oh no. I need to quit. <laughs> that is not hard. <laughs> hard dirt. Yeah, I'm nasty. Look at that spider web in the face. Yep. Okay. If anything, this is a. Uh, if if someone wanted to show you off that you need some foot and fender flares, I couldn't think of a, a better a better test though. Stop. I'm gonna check the uh, GoPro real quick. Oh yeah, this thing's this thing was getting a little uh, mucked up too. Let's 
see. Nasty. All right, I'm gonna stop her out here real quick and see how much battery life and stuff I have on the GoPro. Everything. Be right back. All right, I'm already getting a, a little low on the GoPro. But I wanted to try off this trail. <laughs> uh, I wasn't thinking about uh, how dirty it was gonna be because this, that's not what I wanted to do. So, might go ahead and turn back right now. This is, this is a good little test. Uh, now, if I did do this more, I'd probably have to have to make sure I get some uh, more GoPro batteries because I think this trail will be really, really fun to record the whole way. I just don't think I can make it the, all the way because uh, I won't say this is about 30 miles. I mean, if you can hear this traffic uh, up above me, it goes between Cartersville and Rome, and it's just, uh, I think it's like 20 miles. I don't know, maybe it's like 20, 20 30 miles. I have to double check. But it's uh, it's a lot longer than what I I would think I could do on the range of this being off road and the lower tire pressure and everything. Let's see if I can <laughs> I can uh, go back. I want to at least cover that so I can go back without getting as dirty. Yeah, it's, it's, it's easier said than done, but uh, I'll have fun on the way back at least. Oh, yeah, that's where I went through. Is that, that's a little softer. Okay. Okay, first one. Got the first one done. No horn. No need horn. Is that the other side of the spider wheel? Jeez. Okay, I just went through the middle of this, but right, let's try to go on this side a little bit. Okay, it wasn't as bad. Come on, come on. Come on. Okay, yeah, I, I really don't like mud chunks flying up. <laughs> well, a little bit quicker if it wasn't for that. That's why you got the, the fenders on dirt bikes. Blah. I mean, I'm not really having any issues climbing. I'm actually kind of uh, impressed by it, I guess. I don't know. I ain't never had a real off road mountain bike to try either. I don't know what the real stuff is, but. I don't know, I'm having fun with it. <laughs> Go back in the water. Oh, slip us up. Oh, 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 oh. Where did I go through here? I don't think I went through that little area. I think I went through this, though. Yeah, that wasn't this deep. Ugh. All right, well, we know we can kind of like crawl through this this time, so I'm not. Go, 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 go. Oh. 
Oh, I guess I can. Oh. Ah. Nope. Tires spinning right there. Well, good thing I uh, I rode the bike here instead of uh, put in the car this time. Anyway, I would not enjoy that very much. You know what I think uh that PSI suggestion that uh that was given me thank thank you because I feel <laughs> I feel like I had, was any higher I just feel like that would have been way too much but it's actually been pretty pretty good and so I think I might be sticking with that eight in the front and ten in the back This might have been this might have been my favorite ride to show off though. I mean I had to at some point. Just have to think of some uh, other places. Oh, there goes the pedal. <laughs> oh, there's some briars right in the face. Didn't go down it, but I did go up it. Some credit, right? Oh, you're gonna hate me. I hope this video is gonna have mud in the camera. I won't pay no attention. It is what it is. It's, it's kind of how 
<laughs> how I'm seeing anyway with no, with no fender flare, flares at time. So it's realistic. Battery's still good. It's still showing 100% of that. Okay. I'm gonna check the uh, camera real quick again and see. Yeah, I'm pretty uh, pretty low on the GoPro, but let's see, uh, see if it gets me down a little bit. I'm gonna show, show it more in the PAS9 when I got the uh, actual main battery hooked up. I guess I could have showed my the bike and myself real quick. But maybe I'll get this spot I can. Well, if not, then you got. Hopefully, you enjoyed the little uh, off-road test. And I can I can always just charge up the GoPro again and show it off of the house. Yeah, I'm getting 1200 watts now. I definitely think that makes a difference having the big, uh, the main battery hooked up. Thirty-five. My pedal ain't even out. Slows down up this hill. Come on. Oh, yeah, here's a hill test. <laughs> so I started at 35 and I'm getting down to 16. All out the whole time. All right, now we get back to speed. Thirty-seven. Maybe my max.
trying to help. That's no good downhill for 40. You know what? I just noticed something. I didn't. I didn't air these tires back up either. I'll do that when I get stopped over here. The rooster running. Tires. Whew. Okay. Now let's check it better. I'm still recording. Let's see. I'll stop her right here though. Show it in a minute if I get some battery. Alright. I uh, went ahead and uh, air both tires up to 20 psi for I uh, left the gas station over here. But I wanted to show the uh, damage done before uh, I finish this video off. So, so here it is. I went ahead and took the, the GoPro off me and everything. Let's see if we can get the better things. On. I didn't mean to do any of this. Well, I mean, I guess I kind of did go through every single <laughs> puddle, but what life without the fender flares is like. So, yeah. So, uh, I guess I got a little bit of it there. <laughs> but, that's still a fun ride though. So, but, I think I'm about to get a hold of a bucket <laughs> and a cloth. And I may be cleaning longer than I was riding for. But, it's a uh, lessons learned. Thank y'all for watching.